Take a look at this. A close call caught on camera on I-35 near Ardmore, Oklahoma, just north of Texas. A trooper was helping a stranded semi when an SUV loses control. It swerves and barely misses hitting the trooper in the truck before hitting a median. Emergency officials say they want the video to serve as reminder. There's a law requiring drivers to slow down and move over when they see an emergency vehicle. And speaking of that, it's a frightening reminder of the dangers first responders face when they're working along the side of the road. Today, police in Central Texas are on the lookout for violators of the state's move over law. KXAN's George Rodas is live in Leander where officers are ready to go after anyone who isn't moving over. Morning, George. Good morning. Yes, uh, police say that they are going to be keeping their eyes out for anyone who isn't moving over or slowing down. It's the law. If you see flashing lights from police vehicles, from emergency uh, first responders, from tow trucks, or from TxDOT crews that are out on the roads, if you see their lights flashing and they're working off to the side of the road and you don't either move over or slow down to about 20 miles under the speed limit, you're probably going to get in trouble and you're putting their lives at risk. And police are saying it's a simple thing. You see flashing lights, slow down or move over. But they constantly see people ignoring the law, putting their lives at risk. Leander Police and other area departments are spending the next few days posting up along the side of the road, looking to hammer the message home as powerfully as they can. And it could lead to a nasty ticket. Look, if you hit a police car, an ambulance, a tow truck, a tech stop vehicle, and it's because you're not paying attention, you're not slowing down, you're not moving over, you're not giving them enough space and you hit them, damage the vehicles, you're talking a $500 fine, not to mention you could hurt or kill someone. That's what police want people to understand. We spoke to the Leander Police Department and the Fire Department, both saying this is an issue that is beyond frustrating. It, it is frustration to a point, but it's also scary standing there on the side of the road. We know at any moment, we see the wrecks, we see the lives change from wrecks, and we know at any moment that could be us from somebody not following the law. They need to step back from those things that distract us and, and realize that, you know, we're fathers, we're husbands, and, and we want to go home. We don't want to have to stop anybody. So we want it to, to be an educational process, but we also know that it's going to take enforcement to back that process. We also learned that the state does not keep track of the number of accidents on the roads that are related to people not following the move over law, but Sergeant Doyle says he doesn't need statistics. He sees it enough on the road and he wants to put a stop to it. Back to you.